afternoon ladies and gentlemen I'm me G69 and welcome back to the channel today we are going to have a look at what's in the store what's a good offer and what is a ripoff what's good what's bad now there are quite a few things in the shop we're going to start off with the fearless m4 fl10 now i've already stated this before it's only in the store for a couple more days but for 3500 gold that is a good deal you get obviously one britannia crate uh, with that 14 days of premium 10 of the times fives you get boosters and of course you get the tank as well for three and a half k gold that is an absolute bargain i definitely recommend buying that if you have three and a half k gold you're not going to get many better deals than that moving along of course we have some deals here some samoa uh, samoa tanks which i've already stated yes they are for gold do i think it's worth being in crate no i don't i don't think it's great it's okay uh, but i don't think it's worth trying to gamble for the crate now wargaming are very smart when it become when it comes to marketing of course they have only just buffed the badger they've only just buffed the badger i think they gave it better uh it's more speed more accuracy and stuff like that and then of course they put it for sale Seventeen thousand five hundred gold i think that's a good price to be honest because you do get the uh the legendary camouflage and the attachment with that you get 25 certificates you also get an avatar um and yeah you get it full equipment as well so i think for 17 and a half k gold i think that is a very very fair price for the badger it's not the greatest of tier 10s i haven't played it since they buffed it um according to i think droodles it's it's much better so uh, a fairly good price for a, a decent ish tank um in the right situation of course you've got some more crates there more some more crates you have these three tanks that are still here the amex cdc the the Amex 31ER and the Amex 30B. Pretty good price. Of course, you get 15 Britannia crates as well. You'd only need 10 more if you uh, to get 10 more crates to get the tank if you bought this bundle. Decent bundle for a decent price. A tier 8, tier 9, and a tier 10 for 25,000 gold. A I would definitely, if you've got 25k gold sitting around and you have none of these tanks, then this is a really, really good bargain. Um, of course, moving along, you've got the Rev and you've got the AMX M449, both for 12,000 gold, and you get the five crates with that. Uh, 12,000 gold for two tier eight tanks is, again, is a really, really good price. Um, both tanks are really good. The AMX M449, uh, really good armor, really good turret, and of course, the Rev, it got buffed, it has higher, um, higher dpm um one of them the highest dpm i think mediums in tier 8 so twelve thousand gold is a really good price the same with this one nine thousand gold for a tier 7 a rare tier 7 that's only been for sale a couple of times once i think it was like two years ago and you got the lorraine 40t for nine thousand gold that is again a fairly good price um of course you can buy these all separately you could buy the 30b separately for 15k gold or the amx 31er for 10 k gold but of course if you wanted to buy them two together that is 25k gold you may as well buy this bundle right here for the same price and you get the more crates um of course you could buy the amx m449 separately as well now even separately these are good I mean, 7,500 gold is cheaper than the tier 8s that are in the tech tree, like the IS-6 and the, T, uh, the T-34. Uh, so these are a really good price. And of course, you get it full equipment. You get a couple of crates with that. And exactly the same with the Rev at 7,000 gold. And exactly the same as the Lorraine 40T for 6.5k gold. These are really, really good prices bargains really good prices i'm i'm actually pleased that wargaming are putting these into store for actually fair, a good price they are putting them in for a really good price uh cdc there six and a half k and the amx 1357 for 5k gold really good bundles here in the store today or this week um i do admit and i i have to give credit to wargaming for not overpricing some tanks of course they are overpricing a few things um you can see here 
uh, we have the subscription. Now, I don't like this. You you have 10 lots of uh, 300, which, of course, is 3K gold for basically £5. Of course, you get the free XP, etc. But that means you just got to come back every single day. Uh, and I don't really like that. 10 days. For 10 days, you've got to come back and you've got to pretty much open that uh, to get to get the gold otherwise you if you don't open it you miss out on a day so the the deal becomes absolutely shit um but other than that if it, yeah it's a good deal five pounds for 3k gold plus the the uh, the the free xp etc good prices to be honest um 43 pound 99 here for 35k gold and of course you get the 25 britannia crates which you guaranteed the tank uh decent price again very decent price uh for that uh 22 pound for 15k gold plus the 10 crates again decent price there and you got just three pound here for a little bundle which is all good price until you come to these uh, amx m454 crates 10 pound for one crate of course the first crate is uh, you get three crates you get two extra crates uh, so 10 pound for three crates there and then five pound for for two crates and then uh, when you move over they do become very expensive um battle passes here um the iron and ice the light uh, the light vickers and the tetrarch for three pound again i know it's only a couple of tier two tanks but you know three pound if you haven't got the tanks and you're a collectible that's a that's really really cheap um you still have some ts5 containers which again it's an okay tank but definitely not worth being in the crates and of course you have the more expensive 85 pound for 14 crates yes you do get the britannia for free uh but yeah that's uh that's a little overpriced in my opinion and of course 84 i mean what are you gonna do are you gonna buy this 85 pound for for 14 crates or you're gonna buy 85 pound for 14 crates plus a britannia or a, a britannia panther like yeah logic there i don't know why they do shit like that um because there are some people out there that won't really look properly and they'll buy this one without buying the, the crate one uh so yeah there's a few decent prices as i've said there are a few decent uh bundles in the store um you've got another bundle here the t55a and the camp panzer 17 for 24 pound um that's actually a really good buy to be honest two tier nine tanks for 24 pound that is they're both decent enough i mean the kpf is okay in tier eight it's actually really good in tier eight tier 10 is okay-ish i've never really enjoyed the tank but the more i do play the tank the more i sort of do enjoy the tank um and the t55a obviously if you like the t54 you will like the t55a or you can buy them separately at 15 pound each so there are a few bundles in the store um this week if i was to recommend one just like i was uh, the other day you know what i'm just going to rec recommend this one right here um all the others are good but for three and a half k gold the m uh, m4 fl10 is a complete bargain so i hope that helps guys i hope it um help makes your decision if you want to buy anything or if you want to leave anything um but yeah if you wanted to get the badger at, at 17 and a half k gold with the full equipment and stuff that is actually a pretty fair price as well so i'm midi 69 and i will catch you all soon bye bye